The Huawei P40 series features three different devices. P40, P40 Pro and a new addition to the lineup for 2020, the P40 Pro Plus. The last one has a much more powerful camera setup on paper. It features the 50MP main camera from before but a 40MP ultra-wide snapper, and a 12MP super zoom telephoto camera, which facilitates 10 times optical zoom, which is pretty impressive and enough to rival the Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra. Huawei also included a dedicated color temperature sensor, to prevent the pixels set from emphasizing the warm colors a bit too much, an issue that was present on the P30. The 6.6 inches OLED panel comes with 2640 by 1200 resolution, and has a front camera cutout for the dual 32MP selfie camera, that has autofocus, depth sensor for portraits and can do 4K video recording. The in-display fingerprint scanner has been greatly improved as well, managing to cover 30% more area than before, and feels faster to unlock. Thankfully, Huawei is keeping the optical instead of Samsung's ultrasonic solution that behaves slower, and more erratic. It has a high refresh rate of the display and Huawei thinks that 90Hz stable refresh is the perfect trade-off. While all three P40 models will come with Google's Android 10 operating system, skinned with Huawei's AMUI 10.1 user interface, none of the three will come with Google services, which means no access to Google Play Store. The Google ban, resulting from the US-China trade war, has been in place for some time now. However, Huawei has moved forward with some of its own solutions, with Huawei Mobile Services, or HMS, aiming to rival Google, using companies like TomTom for mapping, 